Hi, and welcome back to our Arduino Beginners course. In this video, we're diving into the exciting world of Arduino programming. This tiny board holds endless possibilities, starting with writing your first program. We'll use the Arduino Integrated Development Environment, or IDE, your gateway to programming Arduino boards. If you haven't installed the Arduino IDE yet, check our previous video on setting up your Arduino environment. When you open a new sketch in the Arduino IDE, you're greeted with a blank canvas. But every program, no matter how complex it is, starts with two fundamental parts, the setup function and the loop function. The setup function is where you initialize your settings. It runs only once when you power up your Arduino or press the reset button. You'll set pin modes, start libraries, and initialize variables here. Think of it as the preparation phase before the main event. Next is the loop function, the heart of your program. The magic happens here running your code repeatedly and creating interactive and responsive projects. Let's put this into practice with a simple example. Making an LED blink, it's a program that you've already seen, but we'll go a bit deeper this time. In this example, we will use the built-in LED on the Arduino Uno board, which is connected to digital pin 13. If you prefer, you can connect an external LED on the same pin and it will still work. Don't worry about it for now. This is something I'm going to show you a little bit later. Now, let's write our program. We'll type the Blink program that you saw in the previous video. I didn't explain how this program works in that video, so let's do this now. In the setup function, we'll set pin 13 as an output with this command, pin mode parenthesis 13, the pin number, comma, output. Output is a keyword indicating that we want to use this pin to send instructions to whatever is connected to it, in this case an LED. Inside the loop function, we'll turn the LED on with the command digital write parenthesis 13, which is the number of the pin where the LED is connected to, comma high. High is another keyword. In this case, it says turn the LED on or convey or write five volts on that particular pin. We can also issue the command low, as you'll see in a moment, to turn the LED off. Now, we're going to instruct the Arduino to wait there for a second with the command delay parenthesis 1000. 1000 means 1000 milliseconds, which gives us one second. And then turn off the LED with the command digital write parenthesis 13, comma, keyword low this time. And then we're going to wait for another second again with a delay command. That's it. Now upload the sketch to your Arduino and voila, your LED should now be blinking. And congratulations, you've just written your first Arduino program. You've taken your first steps into Arduino programming. The setup and loop functions are the backbone of every Arduino sketch, and now you know how to use them to create simple interactions. In the upcoming videos, you'll learn about programming fundamental topics like variables, operators, loops, and functions. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tutorials. See you in the next video.